Howdy everyone, my name is Jay and today we're going to be continuing House Flipper. Now in the last video we went ahead and bought the first and cheapest house. Yeah this one, the camping bungalow. And in this episode I want to work on mainly that but I might have to do a few jobs in order to fully do everything that I kind of want to do. Depends on what prices. Also, I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to do a job that requires doing tiling, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Alright, so it says that it is a small house with a plot of land for renovation but fully equipped, which we read in the last one. And in this one, and now it's saying that the worker who used to live here apparently just left and left everything to go on world tour. And like last time, I do have a drink again, um, so I guess this will be a drink of the day segment. So today I have about a shot, actually a little less than a shot of raspberry Smirnoff, and a little less than a shot of peach schnapps mixed with Sprite, and I will say it is a really good drink, I highly recommend. And of course if you're gonna drink, Please drink responsibly and please be over the age. But I mean, it's not like I can tell you what to do. So I think we got most of the dirt. I did notice when I was editing um, in the last video that I had missed a spot. Is it over here? I just got done playing. I just got done playing a little bit of Minecraft and. This is like weird. I'm trying to redo the controls. It's over here. Is it this? Yeah, there we go. Now the outside is clean as well. We might do the, the gardening. I don't know how crazy I'm gonna go with it. Honestly, gardening's kind of boring in this game, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. So I'm gonna get rid of these. Well, I'm gonna get rid of that one. Jesus, I can't talk. And I am a little bit sick, um, so if I sound very gargly, I guess, um, I'm sorry. Can't help it. Um, let's see. So basically, we have this room, a bathroom, and a, probably a kitchen is what we'll do. And there's many things we can kind of do with this area. Get rid of the radiator. But I think I want to knock this wall out, so the first thing we're gonna have to do is complete a job. Hopefully we can find one that's knocking down walls. If not, we'll do some other stuff. Who knows? And then I really do- I think tile would look good in here, but we can also just do like plain walls. Um, a floor should be fine. Let's kind of look at what we're able to do. So... Hmm, this looks very different from the last time I've seen. Let's look at... the paints. I don't know what kind of color scheme I want to go with yet. There are many very pretty colors, but... Maybe we can do like a dark gray, kind of like a modern open look. Like it's probably going to look like a studio apartment once I'm done with it. Also, it, does, it seems so dark in the house. I guess it's because I took away all the lights. It just seems so much darker than normal. And then I probably will be changing the outside as well once I figure... I'm assuming it'll also be in tiling. So let's complete a couple of jobs first, then we'll work more on this. Additional walls, walls knocked down. Save me from the- that seems like painting. Let's do additional walls. Well, this is a cute house. I wish there was a window right there. That'd make it nicer. Or right here. Either one. Or both. I believe it's 
So we need to knock down these walls and then add one. Okay. Let's get to knocking. Oh, that's fucking annoying. Yes. Upgrade the hammer. There we go wall gone. Now we just need to add a wall. Here. Okay, we need to sew this. And the bed grill. What? Oh. That's not in here, though. I think it's in here. Oh no, this room's done. Oh, we gotta repair an electrical outlet in here, though. Buy a bed grill, duh. At least make this nice. No, I don't have to, but I feel obligated to. Oh, that's also fucking annoying. Ah. Now, before we go back to the house, I do want to see, I wanted to see if maybe there was anything that could indicate that we will be tiling. Not that one. Pretty sure this is just all painting. So at the moment, we'll just go to the house and we will work on the kitchen slash bedroom studio area. All right, let's knock down some more walls. We'll actually look through here. have that. Let's add in these. And we got a new skill. 
I mean, I know we just added that, but let's say that we want them painted. Sweet, so this will be kind of like the bedroom area. And then you walk into the kitchen. It's gonna be a pretty small kitchen. But I think it'll work. Also, we're gonna sell this radiator right here. Or at least the inlet for it. All right, so I guess we could start painting. I think a nice gray in here would look nice. And then we'll do a funky color in here. Don't know which funky color, but we'll, we'll find a funky color to do. Paint. Let's go to the grayscale. Ooh, what about a steel gray? That could look nice. Oh. Forgot how ugly that door was. <laughs> we'll work on that a little bit after this. Say, I don't think I have much to talk about during this... During this video. I mean, I kind of expected said everything that I needed to in the last one. So like I'm not entirely sure if <clears throat> not entirely sure if y'all enjoyed it. I know some people uh, did like the video which I very much appreciate. But my voice could be annoying. I don't know. I need I need to, some like I need someone to tell me, like, hey, stop talking, or, you know, you can keep talking, I like what you have to say. Yeah, I think this is coming along great. And hopefully we can level up painting soon. So we're not wasting as much paint either. So because this is the first house, it's not going to be anything extravagant, and I mean, we don't have much money-wise to like do anything too ext extravagant, but I think we can at least pull it together to look at least livable. <gasps> New skill point! Hell yeah. 20% less paint. Paint's already gone. Definitely think we're gonna need more than a small. But we will get rid of that. There we go. So if we get a decent amount of money from this house, we'll probably go ahead and buy the next house. I don't know yet. We'll see how much this sells for. I mean, eventually we'll have to do more jobs in order to unlock the rest of the things. But these first few houses usually aren't anything too Crazy. Can I not do the outside of that one? I guess not. But we can do the outside of this one. That's weird. Wonder why I can't do the outside of this one. the outside of this one either. Huh. Alright. We're gonna keep the ceilings white. But I think this looks like a decent area. Oh, I should have checked to make sure I got everything. Well, too late now. It looks like I did, because I'm pretty sure this is going to just be white. 
as well as this one, and then the inside will be a different color. I wonder what color we should do. I don't want to do anything like too bright. Are there any nice oranges? No, those are all very orange. What about a light red? Ooh, what about a nice, nice green? Hmm, green in a kitchen. I don't know. I mean, it could look nice, but... I mean, the bathroom's green, but it's not gonna stay that green forever. I'm definitely changing that bathroom. I don't know. I think green could be nice. What kind of furniture can I do for the kitchen? It's gonna have to be small, so I'll probably have to hand do most of it. Oh, there's new hoods. I didn't know that. You know what? Screw it. Let's... Let's pantry. What is this? I don't know. Let's go ahead and just do the walls green. I think it would look nice. Let's do a spring green. I, f I was looking at it and I was like, oh, that's pretty. So yeah, let's just say fuck it and do something weird. And if we don't like it, we cover it. That's what I do with most of my issues and mistakes. Is I just kind of find a way to cover it. You know, I'm kind of liking it. Kind of liking it with the gray. I think we picked a really good gray to go with this color. Could be because it's dark in here, but I won't know until the end. I usually do lights like last because I always get stuck on them. It's annoying. It's kind of cute. You know what this color reminds me of? If you've ever seen the live action Cat in the Hat, it, re it reminds me of all of the houses in, the in that town. Oh shit, what's the name of that town? There's like a whole like rhyming thing at the beginning. Or it's a valley. I, I don't remember. The one with Mike Myers in it. I'm probably gonna change that out. I don't know why I moved it. Yeah, I like this. Window's a little awkward, but... So I think how I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna get rid of these and I'll just replace them. So well, well, I probably won't replace that. I'll probably forget about it. That I can move wherever. Oh, no, I can't. Can I get rid of it? That's weird. So, the one I saw earlier that I kind of liked, and hopefully I have enough money for, I actually didn't look at the price, was... Actually, there's a better way of... $140? I mean, it's not horrible, but it's not good either. I think this nice white, the top, I'm like trying to see this on, along with the color on the side. I don't know if I, I don't know if cream would work. What about a shiny gray? Yeah, because then it'll go with the living room, All right? So we'll get this. This is a lot bigger than I thought. Put it there. 
And then let's get a fridge. I can't spell. Let's just do... Oh. I thought they had smaller fridges than this. Guess not. hell. That's even more brighter than hell. Let's do black for that. Oh, $900? Wait. Oh, they're all that amount. Okay, might as well. So let's do dark. Oh, let's just do matte. Then it's not burning the crap out of our eyes. Looks like it'll fit here. Oh, that's why. I was like, why does it look weird? Okay. Nope, that's still... And we can't fit anything between that, but that looks a lot better than what it was. Wash your hands, get something to drink. Actually don't know if I like it like that. Let's put this here instead. Now again, I am not good at interior design, so this will probably come out looking like crap. But it's the thought that counts. At least that's what I tell myself every day. So we'll get the same thing, except the top, what was it, what did we, light gray? No. Shiny gray. I remember now. Sure. Oh, wait, this is a bar? Oops. Or it has a bar. We don't want that. So let's look up snowmen. What? Wooden covered with oven? What does this look like? Oh, that's a cute oven. I kind of like that. We need to remember that so I can go back to it. So let's go to... Nope, not the kitchen set. Standing cabinets. Let's do... Let's find another corner of the same thing. Oh, is this it? Yeah, okay. I think I found it. So it was shiny gray. I'm probably gonna be moving that window since I want the oven. I wanted the oven somewhere else, but looks like that's not happening. Oh, that doesn't fit. Is 
there anything that will fit? I mean, this will fit, but... Let me... Let me move this over. And then let me just... There. We have one window. That's all we need. Oh, how about the... Oh, it just barely fits. You know what? We're buying it anyway, and we're just gonna move shit around. We'll probably have to sell. Or actually. There we go. And now. We can probably fit... I just want to look at the spacing. It's not a lot. Is there... Is there one slightly bigger than that? What about... Okay, I might be able to fit this one and the other one in it. So that's what I'm going to try to do. And if not, we'll just sell it back. And then this one. Nope. Oh, it doesn't fit. But what if... And we'll get the other variant. And we just move these slightly closer. And I guess the corner's not going to be entirely in the corner like I want it to be. That's okay. I guess. Alright, so now we need a hood. different refrigerators. Oh, did I have to actually type in the word refrigerator? That's kind of annoying. Um. Oh, and it's not very big. So usually there's like a hood. Pretty... And then there's usually shelving above it. So we're going to go back to hanging cabinets. And we might have to move the hood, but for now that should be fine. The other variant. Oh, that's cute. I like this. This is coming together a lot better than I thought. Here's a corner. Let's do this one. Yeah, we'll have it be. looks almost even. For some reason these seem smaller 
than when I last played, but it could just be that it's just been a few months. Let's go back up. What is this? I don't know what that is, and I don't like the look of it. I just didn't... It says it's a wooden cabinet, but... just slightly bigger. Why is it not slightly bigger? This game just does not want to work with me today. Well, not that one. What about this? <laughs> nope. Oh, that's gonna be annoying. It means we have to get well, I won't get rid of it. I'll just put it on this wall for now. Nope, it's gonna- we're gonna have to get rid of it. Oh, that's annoying. I don't like that. It's sad. I really liked that too. Get another one matching the other side. Well, that's unfortunate. I mean, this isn't bad. This is still cute, just not what I was hoping for. Also, it is very dark. So I'm gonna real quick head to the office, sleep, and then come back. Oh, I forgot I didn't have a bed. <sighs> Can I just sleep in? I want the most least expensive bed. Beds. A thousand dollars, but this is cute. I won't lie. This is kind of a really cool bed. Yeah. We get in a cheap bed. I don't even care about the color. By that time, it's probably... Nope, I was gonna say it's probably daytime now. Till the next morning. This is a cool feature. I like this feature. This is kind of a new feature, if I'm not... If I'm not wrong. I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. What? It's nighttime again. I said sleep till the next morning. Did it take us a whole ass day to get here? some bullshit. Also, I thought I cleaned this already. Oh, it might continue to get dirty as we work on it. Who knows? So, I think this is it for the kitchen. Unless we want to do a rug. Might as well. Oh, I do need to get white paint, though, and paint these real quick. White. Board. That's not what I was looking for. Walls. Paint. Grayscale. White. Just small. I don't think we're painting too much. Actually, now that I think about it, this might look weird. Uh, it doesn't look too weird. Right here, we won't really see it, but I didn't even think about... I already got rid of the gray. All the white, but I'm gonna keep it just in case. And I think that's pretty much the kitchen done, except the lights. I think it's a cute kitchen. And we haven't added like any full-on decorations yet, but I'll do that at the very end. 
That is a weird light switch. Kind of cool, though. Um, yeah, well, I guess we'll do ceiling lamps. I usually go for circle lamps, just because you really only have to do one of them. Getting it in the middle, though. And I guess the light switch is going over here. Light switches. They have new light switches. Sorry, there's a lot of these things. Like, before... Oops. When I last played this game, it was literally just these lights. They added so much to this. And I'm kind of surprised. Oh, Jesus, that's bright. Yeah. Is it centered? No. I think. Oh. I think that's centered better. Nope. There we go. That's as close to centered as I'm gonna get it. Yeah, this is the kitchen. Looks not too bad. I don't like when I step out that turns off, but... Yeah. So now that that's done, I'm gonna move the paint. And let's get working in here. Rid of the switches for now. Um, and let's replace the door first, because I'm not feeling that door. Yeah, we're just gonna do. I think it's that way. Yeah. That works. Because I think the lock is on the inside here. Sweet. Now, it's a decent-ish door. Doesn't really go with the rest of the aesthetic, but by me. Oh, we didn't do the kitchen floors. I mean, do we really have to? I think those look fine. We could do carpet in here, though. No, because then I think the transition would be weird. No, we'll just stick with this floor. So this is going to be kind of like a I think I'm just gonna make it into a bedroom. I find no point in making it into like a living room when there's no bedroom. So that's what we're gonna do. Oops. Bedroom. Let's go with beds. Now there are a lot of new beds that I haven't seen. And I'm kind of liking some of them, but double bed. I think a double bed would work best in this room. Actually, I think a single bed would work best in this room, but I think the people who want to buy it are, yeah, the grandparents. They're going to want a double bed. So let's do this one. Let's do gray, white, white. And yes, I do know this is like a weird setup.
There we go. I don't know why the bed wasn't made when I got it, but let's do a bedside table. That is a... Oof. Oh, okay. Oh no, it... That's a bedside cabinet? Or is that like a little chest you keep at the foot of your bed? It's a weird bedside cabinet. Maybe it's meant for a lower bed, but... I don't know. We'll do this one. No, we won't. That's too tall. About this one. Wait, wood? There we go. That one fits better. Um, this place ain't getting a TV. Because, like, unless you put it in the kitchen. Or it's one of those ones where it's like... I don't know. That would be weird. Bedroom's not coming out as nicely. Maybe if I turn the bed, maybe that'll make a difference. I feel like it has to be centered here. better. Kind of not. I guess I could put a small TV here. Do they have new TVs? Nope, looks the same to me. It's a wall-mounted TV. What is this? How small? It's not gonna... nope. I would have gotten it for him if it wasn't off-centered to this. I guess it was kind of my fault for not adding in another wall, but... Nope, not doing it. Whoa. Glitched down on me. Alright, so I think that just leaves... The bathroom. I mean, I don't know what else I can put in here. Oh, well, I guess I can give them some dressers. I didn't even think about that. Probably need somewhere to put your clothes. I guess you can give them one of these. Turn it around. And my dog, again, decided to join me. Hi, bud. You can probably hear his tail hitting the wall. Sorry. Hi, bud. I don't know why you're excited. What? What you want? I don't know what he wants. He's already like... To go potty? Is that what you need? You need to go potty? Okay, I'll be back because I need to take my dog out to potty real quick. Alright, so I'm back and my dog didn't have to use the bathroom. Like, don't get me wrong, he did end up peeing, but he's a senior dog, so usually when he has to pee, it takes like a good 30 seconds for him to fully relieve himself. But as soon as he steps outside, he just starts eating the grass. Now, I know to most people, that seems like, oh, well, that just means he uh, doesn't feel well and um, all this other stuff. Not with my dog. My dog just likes to genuinely eat grass. It's something he's always done ever since he was a small dog and like we've taken him to the vet and everything and he's been perfectly fine also why is this in the middle of nowhere i just noticed this anyway 
That's weird. I think something glitched when we came back, but I don't know. But Buster just enjoys eating grass for no apparent reason. And so I take him outside, he starts eating the grass, and grass is meant to like get dogs sick. That's what they eat so that they can throw up. And he ended up throwing up, but he just threw up grass. He didn't throw up anything extra. So I don't know why he was whining for me to take him outside just so he can eat grass. It's really weird. Anyway. I don't know what else to really do with this room. Oh, I meant to get them an actual, like, dresser dresser. That's what I was doing. Let's just do this white one. We can make it gray, which is... Well, no, I think that'd be too much gray. Let's just do it like that. Oh, I can't fit it anywhere. Or I can, if I move this over here instead. It's a weird place to put it. I'll move it slightly over in a sec. I mean, it ain't much space, but it's not bad. I mean, it's not great, but it's not bad either, I don't think. can actually move it over just a tad. There we go. Good enough for me. Again, this is just like the first house, so I'm not entirely trying my hardest. Just because this, this house is so weird, because it doesn't have a... Like, it doesn't have its own bedroom, and I guess you can make a bedroom, but then it's attached to the kitchen. I don't know. It's just a very tiny home. That's what it is. It's a tiny home. This works great then. Alright, on to the bathroom. What color do I want to do in here? I guess we're not doing tile. So... I think I want... The shower usually isn't it usually across from the from the door? I don't know. I think I want it right here though. So we're gonna move that. Let's go to installations for assembly. Uh this place ain't luxurious enough to get a tub. Oh, now you have to add for freestanding. Or maybe it's always been like that. I don't know. Shower. Let's undo this now so I don't forget later. Oh, I forgot to put a light in here. I'll do it in the end. A uh, toilet will be here. Sink will be across from it. Yep. This is a weird bathroom. I don't know why I did it like this. <laughs> I mean, I don't think I'll hate it. But I don't know yet. We'll see. Um, let's get rid of that. So let's pick a shower. I'm probably gonna just pick a basic shower. We have new toilets. And new bathtubs. Ooh, this is cool. A, thou a thousand dollars for this? Wait. Oh, I guess it has, like, a bunch of settings and stuff. Okay. A thousand dollars. That's fucking ridiculous. Well, we ain't bougie, so... 
I guess we'll tint it. Sure. It's good enough for me, it's good enough for them, I'm assuming. So put this down. Oh yeah, I forgot that's the easy assembly one. Alright, let's get a decent toilet. So I usually go for this one. But these look cool. I guess we should figure out the color of the bathroom before I decide. I guess we could do blue. We have green in the one area, blue in here. Let I'll do a couple of quick jobs and see if I can get tile. I'll come back and finish that bathroom. All right, so I just got done with one job and it actually had tiling in it, which was perfect because I think I kind of have an idea of how I want this 
to go. So for the floors, if I can find it again. Oh, it's like right here in the front. So it's these Neve colors that I really like, or these Neve tiles. I didn't really get a good look at them, but I think a nice light gray on the ground. Oh, those are a lot smaller than I thought. Well, we'll do the walls and see if we like it afterwards. So for the walls... Nope, these are floors. Let's go to the wall tiles. I was kind of thinking... Oh, where is it? This ceramic tile square. I think it looks kind of nice. And I think it'll kind of make it... And it's only going to be on these two walls. And then these two walls I haven't figured out yet. Probably just white tile. But let's see. So we'll get two of them. I don't know why it does this. I don't know if it's a glitch. But like, the first two I can do two walls. Then it makes me do a single wall for the last two. Am I wasting tile? I don't think so. So like, just looking at that, I think that alone looks a lot nicer. And now, we can get just a plain white tile. put here. See, at that time it didn't make me do it. It's so confusing. We're also gonna do tile here. Now I just want the one I'm so confused on how these tiles work. so that I don't have to worry about it. I think there's a glitch with the tiles. Anyways. So yeah, I think this looks a lot nicer. A neutral ground as well as like neutral walls. Grayscale. Uh, kind of like the living room. But still bright. I think this works well. For how small the bathroom is and everything. And if we go to bathroom fixtures, we can do something like this. Now I've never assembled one of these, so this is gonna be interesting. Oh, that's nice. This is a cute toilet, anyway. And then we'll get the thing to match. There. That looks so much better. And let's do the lights real quick. We'll do a mini 
We'll do a few mini halogen lamps. And let's do a switch. We'll just do a basic one, nothing too crazy. Should all be roughly centered. And they were close. Yeah. Got one in the shower, one for where you use the bathroom, one for the sink, and one when you walk in. Perfect. Now we just need a door, I forgot about that. So if we go back to doors, uh, just a normal, and we'll do this one. We'll make it I don't think that works. I mean, it could. It's just a little weird. <laughs> Let me <laughs> redo that. Oh, I think there's actually one for bathroom. Here it is. <laughs> um, except it's not gonna be brown. Let's make it... No, we don't want it to be glass. I guess we'll make it white. There we go. Walk in, lights turn on. Sweet. That's done. Kitchen is done. I think we're done with these paints. I don't think I need them anymore. Nope, nope, we need to put lights in here. Forgot. I'm kind of hoping to find a tall one, but not that one. That one looks... I think that one's a little too much. I just kind of want something nice and simple. don't like that color. Let's make it the same as the rest. Put it here, facing inward. And while we're at it, let's go ahead and add the light switch so we can see exactly what all is lit up and what all isn't. Oh, I forgot that doesn't work for this. Mm. Gives quite a bit of light, but I think we can do one more in the center, maybe with a fan. Uh, getting this in the middle is going to be tough. I think that's pretty close to the middle. Oh, it's a yellow light. Ew. Well, they could be like me, where like they never use this light, but instead use a lamp. Alright, I think we've got the first house done. Let's see 
how much it'll sell for. Uh, I do know there's a garden contest. I've never done it. If y'all are interested, let me know and I'll try and do it, but we're just gonna put the house up for auction. So we made three grand back, which isn't a lot, but for our first house, that's not awful. Let's try to go for $5,000 more on the next house when we sell. So we have 52,000. We could go ahead and get the house that was flooded. Or we could just go to this one. It's four rooms. I wish it told you like how like Zillow and stuff does it. Two bed, two bath or whatever, instead of just four rooms. I can only assume one is a kitchen, one is a bedroom, one maybe an office and the other a bathroom. A house from the 1950s with the original layout of the rooms for general renovation, a large plot. I guess. You know what? We'll go ahead and buy this one, clean it up, and then in the next episode we'll fully decorate it. Let's go ahead and go clean it up. All right, so this is the house. Really dirty already. Let's go ahead and start cleaning things up. Door's broken, might as well get rid of it. Get rid of that and that. Ah. I see now. So one, two, three, four. Oh, this is gonna take a lot of cleaning. Or not cleaning, but like wall destruction. So I'll probably make this area like a kitchen. Wait, no. Living room, kitchen, bedroom, bathroom. No, because maybe we'll move the bathroom or something. We'll figure it out. It's a very awkward standing house. Anyway. Oh, I can sleep here. I've always loved getting bed bugs when I sleep in places. <laughs> the one guy, what? No bed? Trust me, dude. I don't think you want that bed. Get rid of these doors. Like, I'm like pretty confident you don't want that bed. But I mean, hey, you can have them. There's two light switches in here. Which is kind of weird. Alright, let's start selling some of this. Oops. Ah, oh, we have glass. I think that was all the glass. Here's the thing, I can't tell what is dirt and what is wall. Ooh, new skill point. See most dirt. 
because that seems to be my issue, is that I can never find the dirt. I always miss window sills too. I think some of this is on the outside and it's just me allowing it to count or something. I don't know. Alright, now for the satisfying bit. The windows. Oh, that one wasn't as great. <laughs> The windows are clean, the inside is, I mean, as clean as we can make it. Just time to clean the outside. All right. So now we have everything cleaned, for the most part. Sell that. We'll probably sell all of these, like, outlets and stuff. And I'll think of a couple of things to do for this house. I'm thinking about moving the bathroom entirely. I don't entirely like where it is, where you have to go through the kitchen to use the bathroom. It's also it was a really small kitchen. Living room is very weird. And then this bedroom. I'll probably have the bedroom in the back of the house. Maybe it'll be... maybe how I'll do it is make it a bedroom that has a patio. Get rid of these. Has a patio like door. I don't know. And then figure out the rest. So, but that's gonna be it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like and let me know how I'm doing. If not, that's okay. Sub if you want, and I'll see you in the next one.